Hello, and welcome to r r Reviews. Today, you're tuning into our very first audio review. Instead of posting the written portion like we normally do on our Facebook page, we're going to do an audio recording instead. We're going to see how the fans like it, see if you guys are interested in it. Make sure you leave a comment, uh, an opinion about how you feel about either or, maybe you like both. Don't forget to like our Facebook page, subscribe to our YouTube page as always. This week's review is going to be Ron Howard's Apollo 13. Our overall rating for this film is a 7.5 out of 10 points. We described it as a must see. It's literally history and one amazingly moving piece of cinema. So let's jump back in time for this week's retro review. Going all the way back to 1995 where we will examine Ron Howard's two time Oscar winning film Apollo 13. For those that don't know, this is based on a true story of the brave astronauts that helmed the Apollo 13 mission and an attempt to land on the moon once again, following in the footsteps of the Apollo 11 mission. We go in knowing this is history, but of course, even more drama and suspense are created to give the film that cinematic feel. Overwhelming credit and praise must be given to these impeccably calm and extremely intelligent astronauts who attempted to withstand all adversity just trying to make it home. It's needless to say that this film was an immediate success, receiving large praise from critics and moviegoers alike. Not only did it bring home two Oscars, but it also brought in another 24 award wins and a whopping total of 56 nominations. We think that clearly speaks for itself. The film primarily follows the lives of four astronauts. Jim Lovell, played by Tom Hanks. Fred Hayes, played by Bill Paxton, may he rest in peace. Jack Swigert, played by Kevin Bacon, and Ken Mattingly, played by Gary Sinise. It also carries a slew of impressive supporting characters, ranging from Ed Harris to Tracy Reiner, Clint Howard to Chris Ellis, Ray McKinnon, and Brett Colin. With a cast list this impressive, we expect this film to offer nearly perfect performances, and is expected they deliver. Everyone in this cinematic expression is on the top of their game, bringing dramatic and suspenseful performances. There isn't much in the way of character arcs. Other than the trust that grows between the astronauts throughout, these characters are established just the way they are and we attach to them emotionally in that very aspect. Instead of trying to focus on these specific arcs, it shows us much of the wives, the families, and all the people working incessantly inventing solutions to try and bring these astronauts back safely. The score comes across very valiantly and majestic with its tone. It is utilized excellently in that it doesn't overwhelm the film but keeps you invested in the emotion. This cinematic experience comes from a time when the world looked very different. From the technology, the culture, to the very way they spoke. Everything from this era was well portrayed. We also see a great deal of practical effects, something that we lack in much of our films today. It helps still relate a better feel for the film rather than the generic looking effects that we see today. Now don't get us wrong, there is still plenty of CGI in this film and though it is dated now, for its time it is top of the line. However, you can see where they used every bit of practical effects they could and then filled the CGI in the areas they couldn't. Rather than giving us nothing but green screens, they at least attempt to give us a real feel. Apollo 13 will remain an iconic cinematic experience. It nails every piece that makes up an extraordinary film and will remain as one of Ron Howard's highest held directorial works. It even has one of the most infamous taglines to date. Houston, we have a problem. In the end, there truly aren't many negative notations to make about this film. It will grab your heart with suspense and care for these heroes, and if you're anything like us, it may just bring a tear to your eye. R&R Reviews highly recommends this elegant piece of history. <laughs>